Are you ready for some football? The NFL season is here, and if you're excited by the energy but not exactly sure what's going on, our Teresa Strasser is breaking down the basics. Hut, hut, hike. It's Football 101. Don't get me wrong. I love football, but actually following the game, eh, not so much because it's very complicated. If you feel the same, don't fret because we got help from someone who knows just a little bit about the game. You played a long time for the Pittsburgh Steelers, and now you're an announcer. Yeah, and I played for the Chicago Bears, the two greatest organizations in football. That's right. Running back Merrill Hodge is breaking down the basics of football for us, starting with the game overview. Okay, there's 60 minutes, and they split that up into four 15-minute quarters. There's going to be 22 players on the field at one time, 11 on offense, 11 on defense. And both teams have one common goal in mind. Obviously, you want to win, and how do you do that? All right, well, you got to score more points than the opponent. That's Captain Obvious. Listen up, team, because next we're talking how it's played. Now, when you look at the field, there's going to be 100 yards. They're going to give you the ball, and then you got to move the ball at least 10 yards and four downs to get a new set of downs. How do you explain a down, a try? Yep. Every time they go to the line of scrimmage, and you mm -hmm. see the quarterback either get under center or stand there and get the ball snapped to him, that's one down. The line of scrimmage is the imaginary line separating the teams at the beginning of each play. And as for which one the quarterback is. And you know the quarterback because that's the one that's married to a model. Usually. That's how you can tell. Yeah, he can be. He says you want to keep getting downs until you hit the opponent's end zone for a touchdown. Which brings us to the most important part, the scoring. So the scoring could be confusing. It can be, but let's simplify it. The offense is trying to score, and if you get a touchdown, you can run the ball in or throw the football in, you get six points. Then you have to have a kicker come out, kick the extra point, that'll give you a total of seven if he makes it. Let's say you're close to the end zone, but it is fourth down, you know you can't get the first down. They'll elect to kick a field goal. If that kicker makes it, which you hope he does, that's three points. And so those are the two ways to score. And if you don't understand any of the things that Merrill just said. You just pick a team and just start cheering. Energy. Energy. Bring energy, bring this type of get up and you're gonna be okay. And that's a touchdown with Football 101.